Um, of course, um, everyone is excited. I mean, our team, as well as the administration, as well as the, team, the players, we're all excited for this uh, NCAA game. I am new, yes, and uh, there are new things, new system, and then there will be new changes in the uh, ch changes in this team. So hopefully, uh, expectations are there, and hopefully we'll be able to come up, and uh, we'll have a uh, we'll have a wonderful year for this year. Um, we're aiming high, and um, hopefully we'll be able to achieve what we have. Uh, what we have uh, s s said for this uh, NCAA. Team to be. Team to be. Uh, of course, uh, San Vera is uh, the number one team being the defending champion. But considering our place last year, all the, all the rest, all the other teams are the team to be here. Salamat, Coach Gap, Coach Ricky. Agad, on behalf of Coach Brian, who's currently in this year, you know, the for our first game this season. Uh, this year, uh, medyo to sa 15 lang, right? You know, most of our uh, more players are rookies. Uh, for online holdover I mean, last year, so right now we have 11 rookies. So to sa, to sa performance namin to sa last uh, field, okay, medyo masama. So, ang inalam namin na dito sa player namin, sa pili ni Coach Perel na every game, uh, Every game, just give your heart, hustle lang tayo, and hindi natin kung ano mangyayari. Then, doon sa team to win naman, uh, syempre, hindi yung San Beda, and yung <laughs> San Sebastian, and as well yung Arellano, uh, na maganda yung pinakita dito sa last video. And set, especially, sabi nga ni Coach God, isa pinakita rin namin, so halos lahat uh, team to win para sa team na Jerry. Thank you. Oh, I agree with uh, Coach Gabi. Uh, I think to be still in San Pedro being uh, uh, the defending champions. In the uh, next three uh, teams who will make it to the final four, eh, siya na kami maglalaban laban dun. Uh, because we, I believe uh, everybody has a, uh, a, a competitive team. Now, with regards to our showing, uh, your expectation namin for this coming season. Uh, again, it's the final four. Uh, I believe all uh, all coaches, you know, before the season starts, Chepre, we're working hard to prepare for the coming season. Thank you. Uh, so we're all expecting uh, to be there. No? Uh, at the end of the season. But again, uh, it, it will depend on uh, how we're going to perform uh, game in and game on. Uh, to answer your question, I said, I mentioned that it's a bit So, for this team, so, meeting, uh, mentioned that they had to save time. So, but uh, yung top two teams sa atin, uh, team to be for me, for last year, is yung uh, Arellano and uh, San Beda. So. Uh, based on sa aming performance uh, last year sa second round, uh, naka six years kami. So, the community day ako, community, ako bilang po sa uh, is half is sa naging uh, performance na ito. Uh, sana ay uh, pagpatuloy ko na itong uh, two minutes in season. Maganda yung mga, mga nag-experience namin sa mga pre-season tournaments at uh, sana magtuloy-tuloy na ito. Uh, lahat naman ng teams nag, uh, nag-prepare at ng schools uh, sa dating naman ng opening pare-pare sa mga ganyan. Well, thank you, Bill. Hindi tayo yung alumnus din ako sa Peta, pero sa Peta pa rin eh. Ang thing to give. And the rest, pantay-pantay. Ano po? Alam nyo, lahat ng magdasalot po yung mga kilala ko sa mga emosyon. Sa isa ko sinasabi, malas daw ang team mo. Masarap pakinggan kung malalaan na ano. Pero, siyempre, panggati ko ganun na ang team mo malakas. Para matacha-challenge ako kasi hindi mo malakas eh. So, amun sa akin yun. Amun sa akin yung ganun na ano siya. Siyempre sa grupo ng mga coaches, ako nilang nandari ito. 
Siguro dadaan ko na sa experience. <laughs> ako naman, ang um, ako, siyempre nangang ano, ano po at sa ampira, sa Liliano, pero natatakaw ko sa mabuo eh. Siguro wala ako nang higit ako na eh. Ha? Yeah, hindi ko nagigit ako, hindi lang gawa nila. Eh, pareho po si Gato eh, ako na sa ampira sa si Liliano. Pareho po sa Salamat naman. Nang <laughs> uh, pumasok ko sa When I Get Into Makua this February, ang inabutan ko ay uh, kalahati ng team, Ruby. At uh, yun na karalit yung mga lima, eh, sophomore, isa na mga mga graduating ko si Kenneth Tigalo. At meron akong mga uh, parang dapat ko may share sa inyo lahat doon. Malalaman yung gusto kang magkot. Hindi kakagod-kagod mo. Si Nero Player, tinatanong na si Taha. Taha, nasa PBA na. Actually, dapat may room may term kasi eh. Pwede ba sa pag-room? Si Nimis, na pwede ba? Kaya lang may back problem. Hindi ba naayos na sa daw? He's still in therapy. Then, uh, I still have one player uh, who, who left us. He prepared to play for the league. And, uh, yun ang inaputang muntin. Pero, I still believe, ang basketball ay limang tao na wala naman sa loob ng court. Kapag nagkakais na sila lahat at pa-prepareo sila ng mental na nga ay iisip. At, uh, kaya sa team ko, kaya, kaya namin makasila. Uh, kaya sabi ko kanina, don't count us out kasi yun ang sistema ko na inubuo ko sa mind ng mga players ko na yung basketball ay laro ng limang tao sa loob at hindi po pwede isiga at hindi pwede isiga dito lang magaling isiga dito lang dapat lahat yun magagaling kailangan meron kanya kanya tayong mga uh, part na i-share para manalo ko sa team that's how I believe we play basketball kaya pero yun yung sistema ko, medyo maayos na. Kaya, pero ang team to beat ko, GRU. Kasi, bakit hindi ko tatanungin ba, GRU? Kasi siya ang first game ko eh. I will take that one game. One game at a time, so the first team to beat for Makuma would be GRU. Yung LCU Boyet, LCU Arellano, and LCU Hupa. And the best for me. Hindi joke lang yan. Seriously, I take us one game at a time. As of, uh, ang mga 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 mga. Thank you. Coach Atoy, salaman. Coach Boyan Fernandez, everybody is saying na kayo pa rin siyempre nga ang team to beat. Ano ko na, magandang nga po sa inyo lahat. And nagpapasalaman po ako sa mga coaches ko dito. Na at least, na sinasabi nila na team to beat yung sa bed. At defending champion kami. We're looking for four now. The pressure is really too high and kumigat. Pero pagtutulungan namin ang mga players namin, especially yung after the coach of the season of the class, yung dito ko, sa man ko, and the rest of the Sabeto community. Pero sa totoo lang, malakas na lahat ng mga stigma sa NCAA. Sabi nga nila, Dati, pag tinignan mo yung ibang teams, sabihin mo, ah, talaga. Pero ngayon, hindi na. Talaga malakas na. Pag tinignan mo sa team, o yun, talaga malakas na ang teams na yun. Kasi, we even beat the teams from the other teams. So, hindi mo talaga pwede sino-sino yung lahat ng teams dito. Plus, the coaches are really good. Lahat sila magagaling. And I do respect them a lot. And especially dito sa partner ko sa tabi ko. I don't know. Hindi mo lang kung magaling ako po. Saan ka magaling na siya? Yes. So, lahat ng teams magaling. And medyo it will be a tough season for him for San Pedro. But rest assured po na every game may pupunta sa Pedro Lenny to play. And well prepared for the other teams. Kasi lahat po magaling na siya. So, nice enough. Good luck sa San Pedro Lions. Coach Topex Robinson. Good afternoon, and first I would like to thank the San Sebastian Community and the Sir Lucy for 
giving me another uh, tour of duty here with the, with the stacks. And uh, as uh, we all know, we're, we're from where we were last year uh, to where we are right now, we're, we're more of a no-namers. Uh, we're gonna scratch and claw our way up again. But uh, we always uh, try to remind the players that uh, you know there's a big, a big responsibility being playing for such a question stacks because of the, the history that we have as far as the uh, the NCAA season basketball tournament is concerned. So uh, we just we just hope that uh, we we just wanna compete and uh, we wanna our goal is you know winning every game, every opportunity that we we, we have and. From, from those weeks that uh, we, we hope that uh, it's going to take us somewhere. And uh, as far as, of course, the teams to beat, of course, nobody's going to take, uh, you know, the, the of course, the San Pedro is a big target, as much as uh, Coach, uh, Coach Lloyd here doesn't want that, uh, that responsibility to uh, sleep this night still. But, of course, I would have to respect it, what, what Coach Lloyd has done uh, for his team. Actually, when I was Given the, another opportunity, I was actually looking up to what Coach Koy has done from, to, to, to his team from two years ago to, to where they are right now. And of course, not counting all the coaches here, the, the veteran coaches that we know that's going to compete and that's going to give us a good fight. Uh, it's always a work in progress as a coach, but the team that I have right now, Basically, almost all the teams based on the line, I'm just uh, unhappy that the team is bad. There are a lot of rookies and everything to see, so even if you have a report, there are a lot of the line up, there are a lot of bad coaches, from coaches to players, and almost everybody is new. So it's always going to be a work in progress, because what we're doing is to get these adjustments and uh, you can't count out also injuries. So anything can happen in the season. So basically, I'm saying that thing happened is uh, we, want, we must trust everybody in the team. We don't need to trust players that we cannot rely on anyone, but we have to rely on the team itself. So we just have to be prepared in every game. Because in the team to beat, no man. So I'm pressing from San Pedro and San Juan Elia. Sure, perfect. Because they're my intact lineup. So in the rest, it's a toss-up.